Hello everybody and welcome to Vlogmas Day 5. For today's video, I thought I would do a food video. I'm going to share with you guys my go-to breakfast. This is something that um, I've been making for a long time. I love egg scrambles and so does my husband. So I make this almost every morning. I've been doing so for the past like month or so. Um, and so I'm going to share this with you guys. This is a high protein well-balanced breakfast we're trying to eat more vegetables so scrambles are great because you can add a lot of vegetables so the first thing i'm going to do is i'm going to take this uh, pura vita vegetable mix from costco and i'm just going to throw this in the pan and let that saute while i prep the rest of the ingredients for the scramble this one has like um let's see like red and green bell peppers onions um what else do they have in there? Squash. No, oh, it's a variety of vegetables. So while that's going, I'm going to start to prep the eggs. So I usually do three or four eggs plus egg whites. And that's just because eggs are so expensive right now. And we do buy the organic pasture-raised cage for you know the whole thing eggs and so they're so expensive and so a way to supplement is to add egg whites um to your eggs so i'm doing four eggs and then i'll add egg whites to make sure it's enough for both of us um the egg the yolks in the pasture raised organic eggs are really um nutrient dense because they're eating from grass and worms and whatever else they're eating. It actually, um, I might have to switch bowls. It has more nutrients in it, which is great because we all need um, omega-3s and things like that. So I really, if I'm gonna eat egg yolks, I'm only gonna eat them if they're pasture-raised um, because I care about what's going in my food. So I'm gonna set this aside and pull out some cilantro here. And I believe I have my big chopping knife in here. Yes, I do. And I just chop some cilantro. Like that. And that goes straight in the bowl. Don't worry, I'm gonna season it. And then I have some onion here. And I know the, the vegetable mix already has onion, but I like the taste of onions. So I'm just gonna do one rainbow slice like that, and then I'm gonna cut, cross cut. And just throw it in there. And so this is what it looks like so far. Next, I'm gonna season it. It's super simple. I believe in like not complicating meals. I mean, if you're a chef and you wanna get down in the kitchen and you don't mind spending hours cooking, like that's not me. I'm like, okay, will it taste good and how simple can I make it? So then I get down to my seasonings and this is just sea salt. We are not afraid of salt over here because both of us work out regularly. We actually need the electrolytes. Then I have some black pepper. I am out of cayenne, so I'm kind of annoyed. Um, black pepper. Then I use this uh, granulated garlic from Costco. And I put a hefty, 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 hefty amount in there. And then I'm gonna use smoked paprika. I really wanted to put um, what is that? I wanted to put cayenne pepper, but I think I did just tell you guys that we're out. And I'm just gonna whisk it up. And the other thing that I really like is this umami. But after I whip this up, I'm gonna add some of that. Umami is like a earthy flavor and it's like mushroom based. So I'm gonna put that just a dibble. I gotta go to Trader Joe's. I am like out of all my good spices. So, 
now that I've mixed this up and I've whisked, whisked this around, I'm gonna throw it in my pan over the vegetables and I'm going to cut up some chicken apple sausage. This is the ideal chicken apple sausage and I will put it in the um, air fryer and then as it gets nice and crispy, I'll mix it in with the eggs or sometimes we have it without it. I have to see what he wants today. So I'm gonna transfer this to the pan. Okay, so now that I have um, put my eggs in that pan, I'm gonna let them sit for a little bit, let them start to form, get a little harder. And I'm going to chop my um, chicken apple sausage up and throw it in the air fryer so that it becomes a little crispy while it is, while I'm waiting for the eggs to cook a little, down a little bit more. Um, so we're just gonna do one because we already have eggs and egg whites in there. So we're just gonna do one sausage and I just slice it right down the middle. Like this, and then I cut it across. So I have that. You guys can see. So I'm gonna throw that in the air fryer. And that way. When they start to get crispy, you can put them in, in the omelet. Okay, so I'm gonna let this cook up and then I'll show you guys um, the rest of the meal. Okay, so I opted for, so these eggs are almost done. So I'm gonna take my chicken apple sausage and just dump it in there. Just mix it up a bit. And of course, we are going to have a balanced meal, which means we are going to have some um, complex carbohydrates with it. So we're going to be doing sourdough bread. So I toast up my sourdough bread and I'm going to add a little olive oil spray on top. Um, my husband's allergic to dairy, so we don't do dairy. I've said that before. Um, we don't do a lot of dairy here. So what I do instead is I take a slice of bread. And I take my olive oil spray. Like that. And then I add some sea salt. And I throw it in the toaster. And that's how we make toasts instead of using butter. Um, and that way he doesn't have to have any of those weird, like fake butters that have, you know, like who knows what, what ingredients are in there. So then I just take it, put it in the air fryer here, and I'll show you guys what it looks like. So we have our two plates, his and mine. Hope you guys can see that. And I'm going to pull out his bread. And I'm just gonna throw that on a toast and I'm training today so I am having a cinnamon roll because yesterday I trained and I almost passed out because I didn't have enough food and so we are not making <laughs> that same mistake again today um I don't know if I'm gonna put like I like the taste of the cinnamon roll without the you know without the frosting so anyway this has been my go-to breakfast egg scramble with chicken apple sausage and sourdough bread except today i'm having a cinnamon roll all right you guys if you guys enjoy these kinds of cooking videos i have all kinds of foods that i like to cook so if you're interested in seeing it i know this is like not the best video but if you guys like this stuff i'm happy to share with you guys what i cook what i eat in a day and how i make it quick and delicious so um yeah just want to share that with you guys Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe on this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one.